my skin's already been moisturized, so I'm just gonna add a primer. And I'm just gonna be adding the Bare Minerals Prime Time, sorry it's all dirty, um, in tan. And just massage that all over my face. My foundation is a little bit light, so I'm gonna use this just to balance out the lightness since this primer is just a little bit dark. Then I'll be using my NARS Sheer Glow Foundation, and this is in Barcelona. So it's just a little bit light for me, but it'll all even out at the end. So I take one full pump and I just spread that evenly. I'm going to be using my Bare Minerals 5-in-1 BB, and this is Soft Linen. And there are tons of shades too, so Soft Linen is too light for you. You can always get something like Divine Wine or Radiant Sands. Either one of those will work well for you. So I'm going to start in the crease with Feisty. I love how it's a matte mauve shade. I love how it has a little bit of a um, warm mauve tone. So it's just going to warm up the look a little bit. And I'm going to go in with Funny uh, just to darken up and intensify the crease. I'm going to apply that right here to the outer corner. Just patting that on. So I'm pressing it on like that and then I'm going to work that into the crease just to intensify it. Then I'm going to take a really big fluffy brush from Smashbox and I'm going to blend that all in. That way there's no harsh lines. Then with the same fluffy brush, I'm going to go right back in with Feisty, the first color that we used. Soft. Then for my lid color, I'm going to go ahead and take Faithful, this one right here and I'm just pressing that onto the lid. So it has a bit of a gold iridescence to it. I'm also gonna take it into the inner corner to brighten up the eyes. So before I finish up the bottom half and I add my wing, I'm just gonna add some under eye concealer. This is just the NARS Radiant Creamy Concealer in Ginger. And I'm basically going to use that to clean up the shape as well. fluffy brush I'm gonna go right back in with funny and apply that to the bottom so that way it joins up with the top taking faithful that shimmery gold shade and I'm just applying that along the bottom I'm just gonna take a combo of fearless and fabulous and I'm gonna apply that to my brow bone I'm gonna take Schwing, which is a really nice liquid liner it has a felt tip, so it makes it a little bit easier to draw the line, as opposed to like a brush or anything like that. So I'm just gonna create a small wing. I'm then going to add a little bit of mascara and some corner lashes. So this is the Bare Minerals Flawless Definition Mascara. If you don't really want to add lashes, then you can just apply mascara. But I think lashes really do make a big difference. So I went ahead and added some lashes and they're just literally some cheapy lashes from eBay. <laughs> then I went ahead and added some bottom mascara and then I just did my brows. I just filled them in with my Anastasia Dip Brow and I used Soft Brown in that. So next, 
I'm just gonna powder my skin so that way it's not super greasy and shiny looking. So I'm just taking my Benefit Get Even in number two. And I'm just gonna apply that underneath my eye area since it's a little bit lighter for my skin. And that's just gonna help to sort of highlight in a way and brighten up underneath that area. So I just add that to the high points of my face. And then I'm gonna take a little bit of concealer actually for this monster pimple right there and anywhere else I might need it. So maybe right here and I think everywhere else is looking good, maybe right there. And then I'm just going to buff that out. Then for the rest of my skin, I'm going to go ahead and use the Bare Minerals Ready Veil. And this is in tinted. They don't sell tinted anymore, uh, so for my skin tone, I would purchase tan or medium. Then I'm going to use my Betty Luminizer, just like this. It's like a bronzer. Stuck my finger there. <laughs> I'm just going to take a fluffy, small fluffy brush. And I'm gonna apply that just as I would any bronzer, just to the backs of my cheekbones. Oh, it's so pretty. Oh, I love it. And I'm not really contouring with this. It's just gonna be sort of like a cheek color. And these products are really pigmented, so I have to use a really light hand. Then I'm gonna go ahead and take my Mary Luminizer. Looks like that, just a highlighting powder. And I'm going to take a fan brush and just apply that to the tops of my cheekbones. Oh! oh my god, it's so pretty! Oh my goodness, that's so pretty. <laughs> oh my gosh, that's so pretty. Look at that highlight, guys! <laughs> I have cheekbones. Oh my goodness, that's so pretty. I haven't used any of these products from The Bomb. This is like my first time using all of these. And I'm like in love right now. So I'm just gonna take my ring finger with that highlighter, do the tip of my nose. I do right here, the bridge. And since my inner corner is already highlighted, I don't have to do that. So I'm just gonna do my Cupid's bow. And then onto the lips. So for lips, I figured I would be festive and do a red. So I'm just gonna do a red lip liner. This is the Sephora waterproof uh, lip liner in the red. I'm just gonna line my lips with that. So I'm going to show you two options. I have one with a lipstick and then I have one with the lipstick gloss. So some people like just a matte red lip. This one is the Revlon Color Burst in Standout. And it's just like a really nice matte red. So here is the lip without any gloss. But I just want to add a little bit of pizzazz. This one is the bomb Read My Lips in Wow. I'm just going to apply a little bit of that just to the center. Just right here. So this is my finished holiday look. I hope you guys enjoy this video. I hope you have a great, happy holiday. Merry Christmas, happy Hanukkah, happy Kwanzaa, anything that you celebrate. Uh, I hope you have a great time with your friends and family. So leave your comments below. Don't forget to like and subscribe. And until next time, guys.